Hi, welcome to this video tutorial. Uh, Sometimes while working with the Jasper report and trying to generate Jasper report from Java, we receive uh, from Java or in other programs we receive a error similar to this one. And one of the way of solving this issue is to check if um, your tag name, your variable names are correct, or your attribute names are correct. If not, you can also show this. Uh, have a look at this solution that I'm going to show here. Let's go. So, suppose that you are trying to generate a Jasper report and you are presented with some error like this one error retrieving field from bin. Right, you get something similar to this one. So what we have to do is that uh, this happened because um, we're trying to generate our Jasper report from Java. We have a method like this one. And it happened because of the design that we did in the Jasper report. Here is our Jasper report. Try to go to your source code here and try to check if there is no empty space like this one for our case here we have the empty description nothing is in the descriptions you can either fill it fill the description fill descriptions or you can simply what we simply do here is to get rid of that so try to remove this empty field from your reports and depending on how you are generating your report, either from JLXML or from the Jasper, .jasper. so you have to go again here, rebuild it, then copy uh, the file again and come to your um, uh, sorry, come to your um, where is that? Then you have to come to your source code, depending on where you put it. Then for our case here, we put it on the resource here. And if you paste it here, and here I just try to make it simple. And here is the one that I built before, without descriptions. So after doing that, after doing that, saving now, and hopefully. Uh, reloading our program you should be able now after doing this right after doing this one you have to stop so here yeah, after reloading and going again now our error will go and we will be able to successfully run and get uh, our reports our report should be working now so that is it what you have to pay attention here again is to come to your source code there go to the design source code here and remove uh, the empty if any, any any empty field or anything that is empty they just have to remove it and then yeah you are good to go so i hope that these uh, small tips will help you in case you were having this problem and another thing that you may also look at is uh, the case where uh, Maybe you have your attributable attribute name are in uppercase, they have to be in lowercase, and sometimes they are not uh, matching. These names here are not matching what you have in the, in the entity here. So also try to make sure that the attributes that you have in your table match what you have in the Jasper report. Then stay tuned and i uh, hope you like this video if you like it press the like buttons and do not forget to subscribe to my channel in case you have any further concern drop the comments
Thank you for watching. Bye.